Hi everyone. Welcome back to our Node video tutorial. Today we are going to make this. So let's get started. The first step is to import your video and audio files. Now select the video layer. Since we don't need the audio of this video, we can delete it. Then add a time remap property. Tap here to open the K-Frame tool. Now we are going to find the point where the dancer's motion changed and add a K-Frame on it. Now the timeline is divided into many segments. Go to the first segment. Add a keyframe close to the left keyframe. Then bring it closer to the right keyframe. Then repeat these steps to all remying segments. We are fast forwarding this step because all you need to do is follow the same steps for the entire clip. Okay, let's RAM preview it again and see how it looks. The dancing tempo has been changed, but it does not synchronize with the beats. To fix this, let's select the root group and open the timeline editor. Then select the video layer again. Here you can see the waveform. Now we're going to adjust the keyframes timing so that it will appear right on the beat. Okay, let's play it once again. Cool, this looks better now. Let's set a small scale animation to it. Open the transform property, then tap the scale to open the keyframe tool. Go to the first beat and then add three keyframes on the scale.
Change the center scale value to a higher number let's call it 1.2. Select these three K-frames, and then paste them at the position of other remaining beats. Enable the motion blur and let's RAM preview it again. Great! We can continue to add some exposure animation on the beats. The step is the same as the scale animation. Okay, we are done. Thank you for watching this tutorial.